Well, I, I can say categorically it's going to be very good for Hong Kong. Uh, national security is fundamental to any uh, state, uh, any sovereign state, and so I think therefore by enacting uh, national security legislations is going to bring about stability in Hong Kong, and bringing about stability in Hong Kong, it's going to create, insofar as business is concerned, predictability and prosperity. So I think it's going to be something that Hong Kong will need and will benefit from. Well, I, I guess, uh, yes, you're quite right. We don't have the details yet. Uh, but then we have the National People's Congress decision. And if you look at the decision, they lay down five, uh, well, three fundamental uh, points that are very relevant to the question that you've raised. Um, it, it states, and I, I'm not trying to recite it, but it states in, in, in just that um, in safeguarding national security, the one country, two systems is to be enhanced, uh, Hong Kong's uh, stability and prosperity is to be preserved, and the legitimate rights of the people in Hong Kong is going to be safeguarded. So I think those are actually in the decision which the National People's Congress have passed. And, of course, when the National P uh, when the Standing Committee of the NPC is going to do their legislation, they'll have to observe these three fundamental principles that, as Hong Kong um, people, we are all very concerned with. Well, and, of course, when the, N the national security law is to be put into the Annex 3 of the Basic Law mm -hmm. under Article 18, uh, the Basic Law Committee and the Hong Kong government uh, will be consulted. And uh, so at that stage, we'll do the best we can to convey the concerns, which I'm sure we mustn't assume that they haven't heard uh, from the media the concerns and the, uh, uh, the, the requests of the people. So I'm sure that they're well aware of it. But of course, the government will continue to do just that. We still have free flow of capital, separate customs territory, um, we control the currency, Hong Kong dollar, etc. So, so far as business is concerned, it is not going to be affected. Mm. But in fact, with the national security legislation, it's going to bring about stability and therefore predictability, which I think business is most concerned with. And I, I, I think that's the way I would like to, to say uh, or talk about it.